Hey guys, welcome to our today's session. Uh, in the today's session, we'll learn about how to use scheduler uh, in Bubble. Uh, scheduler is a very powerful option where you can schedule any task or any workflow for future. So we'll take a very simple example. Let's say any user who has come to your website and you want to send them a, a welcome email or a kind of one email. And then you also want that email to go over a period of time uh, every day, let's say after every 24 hours. So uh, what we have done, we have put the enter name, email and contact us as our form. We'll go to first, we will go to backend workflow. Uh, I already have this, I'll delete. So what we will do, we'll create a new workflow and we'll name it, let's say contact us. We need to add a parameter, name as a text, email as a text, and we'll create send email. Now we'll link this, let's say email to email, send a name, try no code, subject, hi there, and then we'll say dear name thanks for your inquiry please feel free to reach us below for any clarification regards Try no code, enter it, enter it, try no code.com. So that's how we have set up our workflow. Now we need to go to our schedule page and we say when this contact us is click. Let's say you want to send one email within one minute of someone has submitted the form. So we'll just have a schedule API workflow and then we say contact us schedule date current date and time minutes one name is linked to input name value and email is linked to email value now let's say once it is triggered you want to send it after 24 hours as well so what we will do, we'll have a schedule API workflow here. And then we'll say contact us, schedule date, current user date and time, minutes, 20, sorry, hours, 24 hours, name, email, Okay, so let's deploy this and see how does it work. So we'll go to try no code slash schedule and we'll schedule our this. So we'll say try no code, try no code at the gmail.com and we hit the contact us. So our schedule is started. So we'll go to live just to see where we can see our log course to life and then you see so as you can see there is a schedule which has been scheduled for 27 june 7 50 pm currently time on system at 7 49 api event is contact us and parameters are these two so in one minute it will trigger let's see how does it work so Okay, so it's 7.50, we can, any moment it will trigger. Okay, so as you can see, the email has been triggered and the new scheduled time is now 28 June 7.50. So that means after 24 hours, it will be done. So we'll go to our mailbox and 
we'll see we can see one email has come under promotion so this is the email which has come through so that means scheduler is working so what you can do if you really want this to continue you can do that otherwise you can click on cancel it will not work hope you understood the basic how scheduler works in bubble and if you have any question any comments any suggestion please you can put the comment below and please don't forget to like and subscribe our channel for such tips and tricks on bubble thank you so much